salutations. Before I started this video, I was thinking, I was like, oh my gosh, how do I greet these people? Like, I feel like it's just so much pressure. Like the first word of a video was just like, like the pressure is like, like I'm David Bowie and Queen, like under pressure. I was thinking of hi, hello, welcome. I feel like those are all pretty overused. <laughs> so I tried out salutations. Let me know how you feel about it. And I won't do it again if you hate it. Today, I'm doing an unpopular opinions video. Why do I even tell you? Because it's the title? I don't know. So, I'm an opinionated person. <laughs> and if you know me, you know that. Hey guys. <laughs> but like, I believe if I put out there what I believe, then the people who like hate that will leave. You know, if I say peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are bad, which I don't agree with, that's just a sample. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are bad. And if there's like a peanut butter and jelly enthusiast out there, if they're like following me and they see that, then they can just go ahead and leave. And then there doesn't have to be conflict in my life. Are you getting my gist? Or should I say, are you getting my gif? <laughs> this is the brand of the peanut butter. <laughs> right? So it's okay for people to have differing opinions. That's all right. That's, 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 that's what makes us all unique. And willing to hear what everyone has to say, because otherwise... You know, I'd just be stuck in my one mindset, right? And I've changed. I educate myself. And maybe if you hear one of my opinions today, you're going to be like, oh my gosh, she's right. That's crazy. I, I changed my mind. Or maybe you'll be like, I feel stronger upon my beliefs because of what she believes. I don't know. Sorry if you get offended, but also like not sorry because of that long disclaimer that I just said that was really important. Well, not actually, like in the grand scheme of things, like the billions of people in the world, like it's not actually important, but like what is important? Cause like, we're going into existential issues now. We don't have to talk about that yet. Let's get started. Here's, here's the meat. Here's the meat of the video. The meat, unpopular opinion number one. Apple juice is gross. I said it, come for me. Apple juice is gross. Apple cider is okay, but apple juice, ugh, ugh. Next. So like those Fila chunky shoes and like just chunky shoes in general, I'm a big fan. But you have to know how to wear them, right? Like you can't just throw on those Fila shoes and be like, I'm fashion, I know fashion. I'm fashion. If you put an outfit with it, like if you make it presentable, make it look good, use those chunky shoes to your advantage. Okay. Okay. Go off. You know. I lost my sneeze. This one might enrage a few little people. I started with a few easy ones to just, you know, ease my way into there. Flexing your care for the environment doesn't automatically make you a better person. Care for the environment, good. Like, go ahead. She needs it. She needs the care. But if you're gonna like, I don't know, just like flexing it all the time, I don't know how to describe this. I guess educate people, but don't be like, is that a fucking water bottle? Don't just like attack people. When the time is right, be like, hey, this is bad for the environment, if they're willing to listen. But don't just be like, oh my god, you fucking imbeciles using straws. Like, oh my god, I'm so much better than you using my metal straws. You guys are literally devils for using straws. Maybe either they just don't know or change is slow, okay? So don't put yourself on this high horse just because you care about the environment. If you truly care, that should be fulfilling enough. Next. <laughs> um, I hate football. <laughs> I don't know, that's just, it, that's an unpopular opinion. Everyone I know for some reason like really likes it and I'm confused because I hate it. And my school <laughs> like loves it so much and it's really annoying so like it's just annoying it's annoying for me like nothing against the people who like it i mean i don't understand why they would but like nothing against the people who like it it's just like annoying for me to like live amongst all of you 
you know? Like, stop inconveniencing me with your interests. Because they're just, like, too bold and obnoxious for me, okay? <laughs> I, this is kind of unpopular, but also, like, not. I don't know. But Mo Bamba is a terrible song, and it's a mood killer. Like, I hate it. I hate it so much. Okay, this is kind of old news, but I just feel like I had to include this in here because, like, it just enrages me. Like, I'll just be, you know, at a party. You know what I mean? Like, living my life, and then all of a sudden it'll be like, I got hoes. Ah! That's what it makes me want to do. Just like, <clears throat> makes me want to leave. It makes me want to sit down. It makes me want to go, shh. You know what I mean? Just like, shh, like, why? The whole song is literally just like, ah. And everyone's like, ah. no, no, it's so bad. Okay. This one's like a little unpopular. Jean on Jean is a move, okay? I love that look, but it's gotta be done right. The other night I was out and I had a Jean on Jean on, right? A Jean on Jean on? <laughs> and this boy has the audacity, let alone he is wearing like a long sleeve tee and khakis and he's like, Jean on Jean? <sighs> Fashion mistake. Um, okay, like, coming from you, Mr. Khakis and Nike tennis shoes, like, I'm confused, like, why you're coming from my fashion when you obviously have no taste or style going on over there, okay? Thank you. So that's why I had to include this, because there was just that one moment I felt really attacked for good reason. Okay, lads, ladies, thank you for clicking on this video, giving a little tip-tap on the pad. Oh. Why did I say that? You know what you could also do after watching this video? You could, uh, subscribe. Right. Because then you would be part of a very, 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 very exclusive club. Not even 200 people are in this club. Like, how exclusive and VIP? It's just a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, if I do say so myself. Beyond that, I hope that we can all live happily with our opinions, take other people's opinions into consideration, listen to them, see what they have to say, and have a, a dandy day, um, or night, or afternoon. I don't know when you're watching this. Um, so, see you, maybe never. <laughs>